The second part of the interesting facts. One, there are more than a million ants for every person on earth. Human count, 7.4 billion. Ant count, 10,000 trillion. Of course, it is impossible to count the ant one by one. These are estimates. Two, you could once win Olympic medals for art and music. These days, the Olympic Games are where top athletes from all over the world come together to compete. However, between 1912 and 1948, the international event also handed out medals for creative practices, such as painting, sculpture, architecture, literature, and music. This tradition ended, though, when it was decided that the artist's professional pursuits conflicted with the nature of the competition. Shakespeare popularized the name Jessica. Jessica, one of the most popular names in America for the better part of the 1980s and 1990s, was actually coined by William Shakespeare. The first instance of the common spelling of this name comes from The Merchant of Venice, written by the Bard in the late 1500s. 4. Woolly mammoths were still alive when the pyramids were built. We tend to think of woolly mammoths as ancient creatures who roamed the earth long before humans hit the scene. But the fact is, these giant animals were still here when the Great Pyramid of Giza was built, around 2580 to 2560 BC. The last woolly mammoths disappeared from Wrongal Island in the Russian territory of the Arctic Ocean just 4,000 years ago, according to the BBC. Five, dolphins sleep with one eye open. Our clicking sea pals do this so they can rest and keep an eye out for predators. Here's an amazing fact, the left side of their brain sleeps when their right eye is closed and so on. This is called unihemispheric sleep. Six, in Japan there is one vending machine for every 24 people. With 5 million vending machines Japan has the highest density in the world. 7. Stop signs used to be yellow. In 1922, the American Association of State Highway Officials met to determine a standard design for stop signs, and that's where they decided on the color yellow. Business Insider, stop signs were yellow because they thought that would grab drivers' attention. They'd also considered red, but there was no dye available at the time that wouldn't eventually fade. By 1954, however, sign makers had access to fade-resistant porcelain enamel, and could finally start making stop signs the red color we recognize today. <laughs>